come on. We got to collaborate. We've got to come together and bring our energy into one element of positive source and resource. Your creative energy, my creative energy. I know creativity is an addiction. It drives us all berserk. But in this moment of history, we've got to bring it together in the name of rebuilding, repairing, replenishing. Unplug because we will always say yes to creativity, totally uncut, because we all make mistakes. So turn it into a tool. This is Arrow Unplugged. I was just reading an article, Sydney, Australia, on this June 28th, 2021. Sydney, Australia, very much ahead of the world's time. They're back in lockdown because of COVID-19. Sydney, Australia, not the back roads of America, not in the fields of some country that people can't even pronounce, but Sydney, Australia, a year and a half beyond where we once stood on that March 12th, 2020, and they're back in lockdown because people won't get the shot. Now, I'm not going to turn this into a political thing. I'm just I'm just kind of setting this up in the way of saying Sydney, Australia. In lockdown on June 28th, 2021. Here in the United States. Oh, we think it's great. We're free. We're out here. We're moving around. Woo! Big time party. While Sydney, Australia sits in lockdown. Hey, it's Arrow. This is Stream Thinking, the power of now. I challenge myself every day to write one page. Ten minutes. That's all. Just ten minutes. No editing whatsoever with plenty of time to talk about it in the end. See, what it is, it develops a relationship with the inner core of your presence in the universe, learning to trust free-form thinking and writing. Because I believe that our best decisions are made right now. And you've got to own your leadership or somebody's going to come by and they're going to own you. (laughs) Corporate America, man. You know what it's about. They want you. They need you. They got to have you. They want your soul, baby. The power of now. This is stream thinking. Because we couldn't, and now that we can, we won't. I can still hear your voices. So many people angered by having to wear the COVID-19 mask. We couldn't get into our gyms. We missed the live performances with comedians and rock stars. So many of us felt trapped. We hated being told what to do. Just as fast as the pandemic started was just as fast as the mask came off in May of 2021. Now, this is all here in the United States of America. I'm not talking about Sydney because they're in lockdown. The doors opened here in the States in so many businesses. The rock stars and comedians are finally starting to book their gigs again. But here's the thing. Movie theaters, you know, the big screen All that sound, popcorn, Cokes, chocolate. Yeah, they're not filling up. Big movies are being released, but the seats are nearly empty. The fast food and dining patios are overflowing. Beer gardens are pouring. As for movies, no. Barely anybody is showing up. I can't help but wonder if binge-watching TV has changed everything. I mean, not everything in the world of new flicks is digitally available. Is it no longer important to be one of the first to see? Is this the brand new beginning or the movie theaters ending? We're out there. Oh, my God. I'm on the front line. I see you. I talk with you. I see that you've lowered the mask. Some still wear it. Good. I'm proud of you. But the question is, we have all of this freedom, but we're not going to the movies? How is this possible? You can go anywhere now. There are no limitations as to where you can't go and grow. And the movie theaters are still taking the hit? You want to know what else is scary? Legendary restaurants are falling off the map. Price's Chicken Coop in Charlotte, North Carolina. Been in business for 59 years. COVID hit. People started to become free, and they didn't return. Zach's Burgers over there in South Boulevard in Charlotte. 
40 plus years. They made it through COVID-19. But once we're free, nobody showed up. What are you doing with your freedom? What what are you doing? Where are you going? You get you got all of this room that you can now participate with unless you're in Sydney, Australia, June 28th, 2021. You've got all of this. You don't have to stay at home. You don't have to wear a mask. You can go wherever you want to go. And you're not. You're staying away from those places that once gave you an escape. I, I, I don't understand. Is this what it was like when the Berlin Wall fell? People finally said, Woo! Oh. Well, okay, um, now what? I'm Arrow, and that's Stream Thinking. <laughs>